Who's there? Luke. Luke who? Look through your peephole and find out. I don't have a peephole. Then look behind you. Go away or I'm calling the cops. Away. Who's there? I'll call the cops. Luke. I mean it. Me too. Just fuck off, you cock lunatic! Okay. Fuck this. Hey, my name's Holly Hargraves. I'm the writer, director, editor, and this is Behind the Scenes of Knock Knock. So there's something really creepy about the Knock Knock jokes. Knock Knock, who's there? I just thought it would make a really good, <laughs> a really good horror film. Script. So the script is here if you want to pause it and read it. Casting. So I had someone locked in for this, but the night before the shoot, she messaged me and said that she was sick, so she couldn't make it. This was about 5 p.m. the night before we were about to shoot. So I had about 24 hours to find a replacement, but Kid Hudson, the DP of the short, actually came to the rescue. So he sent me a bunch of actresses' names and Olivia was one of them. So I messaged her. I'm like, can you do a self-test for me now, tonight? And so I sent her the script and within 30 minutes, she sent back this. Knock, knock. Go away! Who's there? I will call the police. Luke. I, I mean it. Luke who? Just fuck off, you called lunatic! Thank you to Kit Hudson, the DP, for finding me Olivia, and thank you to Olivia for stepping in at short notice. Pre-production. So with every short film, I always open a new Google Doc and I write down all my thoughts about the project and who I want to cast and who I want to DP it and the locations and the props and all that sort of stuff. Production.
So we shot this over a four hour period on the 1st of September, 2022. There was only four of us, myself, Kid who shot it, Carly who did set photography and AC and everything else in between, and our actress, Olivia. Knock, knock. <laughs> in regards to equipment, Kid shot on the Sony FX3. I captured sound on my lav and I just have like a cheap Boyer one. And yeah, we banged out the short film in four hours, which is pretty good and everyone worked really well together. Post-production. <laughs> so I feel like there's challenges with every single short film and the challenge with this short film was the edit. Oh my God, it was so annoying. So basically we shot on 4K and I have a MacBook Pro, but it's old and it just hates 4K and it just wouldn't play through properly so I couldn't actually watch performance and yes I did use proxies but for some reason that didn't work either so it was just a really long slow frustrating edit for me and with these BTSs I want to be really honest I don't want to paint a picture that it's really easy to make monthly shorts because it's not it's actually really hard and it does take a lot of time and effort and sometimes things go wrong so for this project it was the edit it was so frustrating but we got there guys I got there in the end thank goodness a couple of weeks ago, I posted on my community tab a couple of ungraded stills from my next short film, Burn. And so I was supposed to drop Burn in September, but there's just some sound issues, which I'm getting cleaned up. It's with a sound person at the moment. He's just cleaning up the dialogue. It's no one's fault. It's just because we shot on a Saturday in a busy area in my neighborhood and there are cars and dogs and people and all that sort of stuff walking around. So the dialogue needs to be cleaned up and it's just taking a little bit longer than anticipated. So I'm actually going to drop burn in October around about the 15th, 2022. So keep an eye out for that. And so I thought I would drop Knock Knock first because it just came together quicker, even though the edit for Knock Knock was kind of frustrating. The whole film sort of came together quickly, quicker than burn. So look out for burn though. Thank you.